welcome back to another video. If you guys are new here, hi, my name is Kinsey. Subscribe if you guys want. I am so tired right now that I can barely even get a word out. I've been trying to film this and it's just, it's not working for me. So we're about to go get a pumpkin spice cold brew. I got back from New York yesterday. Um, I spent all last night cleaning. I actually got a lot done. But in this vlog, we are going to be decluttering. We're gonna start with the closet, and I already did my pantry last night and got some stuff done, so I'm feeling good. I've also just been really off my health game. Like, yeah, I've been like active, but I haven't been eating well at all. I've really noticed just feeling horrible the past few weeks, so we're getting back onto a healthy grind. I'm going to be cooking from home. I actually joined Prep Dish which I've been hearing about on podcasts a lot. I'm actually dying right now. Most of that just got me into Formula One racing. And there are so many of you guys who are replying and like DMing her now about their Formula One podcast. That was so funny. Anyways, I need to get back into a healthy routine. So I joined Prep Dish and essentially they give you like a menu for each week. So it's kind of like what I used to make for myself. It's really healthy. They know a lot more of what they're doing. Um, and then it gives you the menu. It gives you like your grocery list essentially. It's only gonna take me an hour. And then it gives me all of my meals. You have five meals. It looks great, okay? So I'm gonna try that and I'm gonna keep you posted on how I like it. I feel like I'm going to absolutely love it because it's right up my alley. It's really inexpensive. And I just love trying out new recipes. So we're gonna go get a pumpkin cold brew. We're gonna go to Trader Joe's. I've been wanting to try Magic Spoon too for so long. And I'm very happy because I got back from New York and I had four boxes waiting for me. I just have to say, this is like the best cereal ever. I am such a cereal person, but I never eat it anymore because they just always tell you how bad it is for you. But this is healthy cereal essentially, or like a healthier option. It is so good. Cannot recommend enough. This is the only one I've tried so far. I mean, like, look at that, guys. That's crazy. Hi, can I just get um, an order of egg white egg bites? Yes, and then um, can I get a grande cold foam cold brew, two pumps of sugar-free vanilla, and then one pump pumpkin spice in the foam? I think I ordered that right. I Googled it online, but it's like a healthier version of the pumpkin cold brew. By the way, I literally eat Taco Bell. Like, I'm not this, like, crazy health person. But when it just comes to, like, my everyday daily routine, I want to find, like, the healthier versions of coffee because when I drink coffee that's, like, crazy sugary or, like, way too much milk, things like that, I just get really tired. So we're just trying out things here. Also, I want to take better care of myself. So, here we are. Thank you. I like your hair. Thank you. It's a little faded, but... <laughs> yeah, it looks good. Thank you. Perfect. Have a good day. Here's my Starbucks drink. We'll do a taste test. I, I was about to say don't worry y'all like I've literally been back in Texas for less than 24 hours guys. Okay, grocery haul time guys. I will say I definitely spent a little bit more than normal like 120 because I got steak too. With what I'm using, I wanted to try all five meals the first week. Realistically, I could probably do like two to three of them and just pick and choose. I'll figure it out kind of as time goes with just like meal prepping and planning how many meals a week I want to do. But I just love cooking, so I'm in like a cooking mood and it really helps me wind down at night. Like, I feel like I achieve like inner peace at that point when I'm regularly cooking. So anyways, I did spend like 115 on groceries at Trader Joe's, which is a lot for like one person. Anyways, we have some butter lettuce because they're out of something else. English muffins, which this is a new breakfast I'm gonna try out that's not from like the meal prep thing that I'm doing, but just wanted to try it. Cherry tomatoes, portobello mushrooms. I love mushrooms. Got some almond milk for my Magic Spoon cereal. Avocados, sweet potatoes, and these are like really big. Some corn, I don't have a grill though, so it's like, what am I gonna do, you know? Red onion, some eggs, I've been on an egg kick. I feel like I'm either wanting eggs every single day or I don't eat them for two years. Garbanzo beans, chickpeas, I used to eat these all the time in LA. I got the 21 seasoning from Trader Joe's. Oh, breadcrumb, zucchini, garlic, and then quinoa. Arugula, spinach, um, these cauliflower thins, we'll see if I like them. Cheese. Green beans, ham, cod, salsa, this is so much food, chicken, butter, mustard for like a sauce, steak, and then chicken again. This is truly a lot of food. I am Martha Stewart this week. I really truly am. I'm gonna be living my best life. 
I'll be making lots of recipe reels and stuff. My like food and recipe stuff always does better on Instagram and I know you guys really request it on YouTube so be really specific in what you want to see on YouTube for f meals and stuff because I never know. Anyways, I'm actually going to start with my meal prep. I'm gonna put this stuff away. I also got some more flowers. I know we're shocked, I always have flowers. Yeah, then get going and then I'll update you guys as time goes on. always have this going in every single room in my house at all times it is so cozy again I don't care if you think it's tacky it makes me happy it's 7 p.m. I'm in my pajamas and we're gonna go make some dinner I have Selena Gomez's new show on guys this thing that Dom got me for Christmas I think is the best thing ever you just put your iPad here for recipes I mean love it such a good gift I made some cod with some recipe that they told me to and a sweet potato. I used to eat sweet potatoes all the time. This video is really turning into like a that girl vlog hi bud. Um, because we're taking care of ourselves, we're getting organized, I'm getting active, we're getting healthy. Fitz is loving the camera. He blends in with my clothes. I mean my background. I see you took your toys on the bed. That's so nice of you. Dude, I think he thinks that I want him to sit here. Okay. Do you want to sit? Maybe you can watch. Sit. <gasps> Good boy! Okay, do you just want to watch? Okay, here we are. Coco's right here, by the way. Before I get comments from all of my haters out there, I obviously don't favor one of my dogs. Oh, chill out, dude. I obviously don't favor one of my dogs. Just like, you literally cannot see Coco in the shot. Okay, you have got to go. If you're gonna be rude, you need to leave. Okay, so I'm gonna give you guys a little book update of what I've been reading lately and what I recommend. This has got to, you've got to be joking, Fitz. Like, you have to move. I, I'm not kidding. I'm currently, like, 50% of the way through the Midnight Library, and I'm not loving it. Like, I really just want to get it done. I've already committed to reading it. If I'm past probably, like, 30% in a book, I just feel like I have to finish it. I read Stop Walking on Eggshells. My therapist has been telling me to read that book for the past year plus, and it has changed my life it is such a good book oh when i was in new york i read fearless by rebecca minkoff and it was really great currently also reading i will teach you to be rich i don't normally read multiple books at the same time i don't ever read two fiction books at the same time but i can read a fiction book and a non-fiction book at the same time oh my god okay i read pack up the moon by Kristen higgins Oh my god, that book wrecked me. Like, if you want to cry and you want to be really emotionally involved in a book, read that one. Okay, I need to actually check my Goodreads. Do you ever read a book and then, like, literally forget everything about it the next week? I'll have my Goodreads linked down below, by the way. Golden Girl by Elin Hel Hildebrand. I can Elin Hildebrand. It's not so hard. I rated it a three star. I liked it. I just felt like it kind of... I don't know. I think actually three would be like a little bit low for me. I'm typically like always a four if I liked it. Um, I definitely liked it, but I prefer 28 Summers, but I do like the book. I would recommend it. I read like Slammed and Finding Perfect and Finding Cinderella really quickly because I want to have read every single Colleen Hoover book. And I think the only two that I haven't read are... What is it, like Finding Someday or whatever? It's the last, like, two in that series. So I need to read those two, and then I think I've read every Colin Hoover book. Um, yeah, I feel like that's pretty much one that I haven't talked about. I don't know. I feel like that's good for this portion of the vlog. I um, hope you guys enjoyed. Um, as always, follow me on Instagram because I'm constantly sharing what I read on there. You guys can follow me on Goodreads as well. Um, I'm doing a reading challenge, so... This year, my goal was to read 100 books, and I'm currently at 67. It's 8 p.m., which means that I need to go read. Also, my alarm clock, I used it, oh my god, the alarm clock, I used it for the first time last night, and I just want to say, wow. I mean, wow, 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 wow. Has this been an incredible addition to my life? I have had it for, I've used it um, one time, and... I slept so well last night. I love the features. I love the lights. It just, oh my God. 10 out of 10. If you're on the fence about ordering one of these um, alarm clocks, you need to get one. Okay, now I'm gonna go read goodbye. 
Good morning, everyone. Hey, what's up? Like, literally as soon as I hit record, the dogs do something. Look at my outfit. Moon of Lord Elizabeth. So cute. My merch drops tomorrow. I will link it below if there's anything left by the time this video goes up. Okay, good morning, guys. While we're back on the that girl kind of thing, we've already talked reading. I'm gonna declutter my closet. I'm gonna try um, another Magic Spoon cereal. I don't know if I did this in the vlog yesterday, but I tried the peanut butter one. It was so good. Oh my God. I'm getting my big goals out for this. I am like such a cereal person, but I never have it anymore. Like, this is like literally half the bag because that's how big this bowl is. It is so good. I like the peanut butter one better than this, but this one's still really good. Okay guys, we have quite the problem here. Oh, hello. I don't know, I just didn't realize the size of this. And now obviously it's not gonna, this is not what it looks like. I just had that there purely for my own comfort and to sit there. This couch on its own with just two, it's not big enough. Like I just prefer a much bigger couch. So I wish that I could just like have another piece right here and then do a sectional. But the problem is that it's just so big in this space and then that's too big here, I don't know. This is situated like this solely for my own comfort. Um, it's obviously not gonna look like this. I have considered just having a huge sectional here and it would go out, it would be the same size as this basically and go out um, just cause I feel like I would use it a lot but it is just so big for the space because as of right now, like that couch, I just don't like couches that aren't sectional so I don't use them that much but yeah, it's been quite the mess guys. Why do they have to do all, this is so annoying, like why couldn't that have come out more? <laughs> Hey guys, just finished the recording. Now I'm on a brainstorming call with TK. What's up? Good morning, Jake Paulers. Oh my God. So I actually just filmed an entire video decluttering my closet in under an hour and my um, guest bathroom was kind of just turned into this disaster. I'm gonna show you guys. So we're gonna declutter that in this vlog. If you guys wanna see the um, closet one, it's gonna be its own vlog. I'm not sure which one's gonna go up first, but I have these bags right here that I'm gonna give to Taryn, because it's her turn for clothes. Um, I typically always give them to friends and, or I'll donate them. What? I mean, some of this is Dom stuff, but it's just like simply not okay. This is what I use as my like beach bag. Honestly, I am gonna throw stuff though. This is one of those things where I eventually am going to just like completely redo my bathrooms and since like no one really even uses this bathroom honestly, like even when people are here and like getting ready to like go out or something, everyone ends up using my bathroom. I don't know why, but maybe because it looks like this. I just don't really ever use this bathtub. So for this time being, it's gonna be storage. Guys, I can't, like this has been stressing me out for the bathroom has looked like this for the past month, and it quite literally just took me one minute to clean up. I mean, whatever works, you know? Earlier today, I was in denial. I obviously knew that that was not gonna work, but I was just really not wanting to deal with it, right? Um, as much as I want a sectional, that's just not gonna happen. And I realized today, but the next best thing would be to get a love sack right here because this is only going to stand in. So I want to get a chocolate brown love sack right here. I mean, oh my God, can you think of anything more comfortable? So that is a plan now. Um, I was just looking online at their stuff when I was supposed to be working. So that's a little update on the living room. I feel like that is going to make a lot more sense. I have probably like an hour or two more of work and meetings and stuff. But I just changed into this outfit because I'm gonna take the dogs on a really long walk. We're gonna do like an hour walk um, this evening. This top is Year of Ours. These biker shorts are outdoor voices. I've just been eating my chickpeas that I meal prepped yesterday, drinking my water, editing this vlog actually, um, and just sending stuff in. I made a TikTok with Dolly Parton and I have a call in two minutes. 
So I'm gonna hop on that and then I think I'm pretty close to being done with work for the day and then I can go on my long walk that I just can't stop thinking about even though it is 100 degrees outside. Guys, I am like laughing at myself because I take this walk so seriously. I mean, getting the AirPods. Here we are. My Lulu belt bag, which by the way, I'll link it below. If you go on walks a lot, you need this bag. It makes your life so much better. Got my work done. And now we're gonna listen to a podcast, go on a walk. I'm gonna come home. I'm gonna cook dinner, shower, read my book. I started the We Are The Brennans, I think. Mm. Also guys, I got a package from Casey today. And look at how beautiful this is. Like, it's so cute. K-E. I love that. Um, and they gave me a new phone case. And it just says Kinsey here. Not sponsored. I actually don't have a deal with case to buy. I'm, I think I'm the only person in the world. So I got a package from Doe, which is, like, my favorite healthy, um, cookie dough, literally right here. It is so good. If you haven't tried it, it's like a healthy alternative to cookie dough. The chocolate chip, I like every single flavor. Like, they're so good. Oh, my God, no way. But there's this thing, Chubby. I don't know if it's the same brand or different or what. But it's like an Uncrustable. No way. We grew up on Uncrustables. No way. This is, like, the most exciting thing ever. Okay, so I am really pumped for this. They also gave, like, a cute little lunchbox, which honestly will probably come in handy at some point. I love this so much. Okay, well, thank you so much, guys. All right, I'm now cooking dinner, listening to Book Club Podcast. I made this as a snack as I'm going to make dinner. I actually can't make what I thought I was going to make because the avocados are just not right. So I'm going to save that meal for tomorrow. And I'm actually going to try. This is really a food vlog. I just have been getting a lot of, like, food PR. Um, truff, I don't know if this is good for you. I don't really care. It's the black truffle pomodoro um, pasta sauce. It looks good, so I'm gonna make this and pasta and then probably some spinach. All right, I finished my meal. All right, I made dinner, I showered, I got back into these clothes because I really barely wore them and I was just in my house today. Evening time in my room, there's just nothing like it. I brought up some beverages, okay? I haven't put like a non-alcoholic drink in a wine glass. Honestly, I don't really even drink wine that often. I do if I'm like really entertaining and I haven't been entertaining that much recently, but I used to put like kombucha on my recess drinks. If you guys have never tried these, by the way, um, I love these. This is the mood one, but they're just really good for like calming you down. When I have bad anxiety, like a midday slump, these cure me. I can link this below. This vlog is literally just like unique food and drink that you can probably get at Whole Foods. Like I don't, I don't know why that's happening. It's just, what can I say? My interest, you know? Um, but I just always drink them in my cute little square wine glasses. I'll link them down below. But it really elevates the experience. Like, I love, love this. Dogs are so tired from their walk. It's so cute. Whenever I get a new phone case, it feels like you got a new phone. And I swear to God, this is not going to make sense. And I, and I can't really, I have no scientific evidence to back this up. But my phone camera quality has improved. Since I put this case on, I was out recording a few things when we were on our walk. And I was like, what the heck happened? Like, this camera quality, I, I felt like it's gotten, it's gotten worse recently. New case on it? I don't know. 7 p.m. and I was going to just start reading and read the Redheads book club pick because Margot has said such great things about it. And I am going to do that, but BFS podcast is released and I have a nice face mask on and I'm just gonna get cozy with my little mood, um, recess mood drink and my candles in my room and my, my room set. You know what? Another thing that you really need, this stuff, I swear by it. Um, I've showed it on like Instagram, but it's the Antica Farms, I want to say. I can't remember. Room fragrance, vanilla, bourbon, and mandarin. This stuff smells so good. Like, your room will never smell better than if you use this. If you spray it in the fans, I'll like close your eyes, you know. It smells incredible. So anyways, we're going to watch BFS podcast and read. If I remember, I'll show you like the vibe that I have at night that's just so incredible. It's 8 p.m. Um, my camera is kind of being annoying, but... The dogs are here. I have my lights turned off. I've started my hatch restore like nighttime routine. So this light, like I, you will never be able to understand how calming 
this room feels. I'm sorry for the camera. I don't know why it's doing that. I have my melatonin, the rest of my drink, and then I'm just gonna get to reading for the rest of the night, but it is so calm in here. Um, the camera does not do it justice. It is just so calm. Hi guys, it's the next day. It is 8 a.m. I just did my little like 5 a.m. miracle morning routine thing. I'm filming, I'm filming my mornings all week. It is now 8 a.m. and I'm actually gonna go to an 8.30 core power class. It has been so hard to get me to go to core power this week. I don't know why, like it's been hard to get me to go this week. So I'm going, the sad thing is the 8.30 class, if I don't make it to the 7 a.m., all the right hour and the 7 a.m. class is 45 minutes, which is really why I like that one. I'm dead from that workout. I've changed. This is my crazy outfit for the day. It's so hot in Texas. Like this time of year, I can't even think about my outfits because it's just so miserable. I've been really focusing on drinking a lot of water. And this really helps me. My hydro drug helps me even more. Merch drops at noon and then I have therapy at one. So I'm getting that stuff together and I'm going to make a new breakfast. Oh my god, also, my favorite podcast came out. There is a new episode of my podcast with the Set Active team. You guys can watch it on YouTube or it's available anywhere podcasts are found. I am, like, obsessed with the world's first podcast with the Foster Sisters, and yay! Two eggs, ham, cheese, salt, pepper. <laughs> Yet another trendy food item. I'm gonna try the Truff hot sauce for the first time ever. So the presentation could be better, but it looks really, really good and it smells really good. Okay, this is so good. It is later. I went to therapy, I went to Sephora, I got a new self tanner, I self tanned. I picked up some skincare replacements. Ooh, I did get a new PR package. This is very exciting. It's Thursday night and I'm actually gonna go to Hero to watch the game with my cousin and her boyfriend. I love fall. I know it's not fall yet, but the fact that it is September makes me so happy. Yes, it is still 100 degrees outside, but like I'm just gonna pretend, okay? Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Let me know what you guys wanna see in the comments below. I kinda wanna do like a that girl guide. All right guys, hope you enjoyed. Subscribe if you guys are new here. I love you guys so much. And I will have a link to merch down below. Bye. I was thinking about this on the way here. I know that everyone just has to know all the colors. I would never in a million years be able to memorize all those names in different colors. So I actually was thinking that wasn't lychee. I think that's smoke. Oh. No, is that it is brand lychee. New? Did you just get it?